Hello everybody. Or should I say, oh, what's up guys? Liam here, welcome back to LSJ TV. I am struggling today. It is very late on in the day. I am not wearing a watch. It is very late on in the day. I've got more YouTube videos to edit. I've got this video to film and edit. I've got to send client videos. I've got to upload my own video. I've got to do TikToks. I've got lots to do. You know, I talk a lot of the time about something has to come from somewhere. Um, that is something that I've realized a lot over the past few months in particular. Yeah, today's one of those days. Um, and unfortunately, it's gonna have to come from sleep. <laughs> See, in between training and filming and editing what it is that I'm filming, whether it's for myself or for clients, or just enjoying myself socially, actually trying to have some form of social connection with, with other human beings rather than being sat in this very spot editing on my laptop or going to the gym and just training and, and just being I feel like a robot, you know, in between all of these things, I have to try and balance all of them. How successful am I? at that. Honestly, with, if, I'm, if I'm completely honest with myself, not very. I'm not very good at it. I'm getting better. I'm a hell of a lot better than I was six months ago or a year ago. But it's, it's something that I really, really need to work on. Um, as you'll see from the training footage that's kind of going to be sporadically put throughout this video, I was pissed off in this session. Um, I have a lot going on right now in my life. A lot that's on camera, a lot that's off camera, and I was pissed in this session. I wanted to train, I had to train. I needed to for my mental health, simple as that. I needed to go, let out some energy, feel good about myself, look a little bit better, hopefully get a bit of pump, you know? All of these things were contributing factors as to why I chose to go to the gym on this day. Did I really have time to go to the gym? No, I had so much work to do, I still have so much work to do, and I wanted to go to this event, right? We have managed to get on Friction's guest list to go to a DMB kind of launch event thing for his new song, um, so I want to go to that. But I was pissed at this session because of these things going on. Normally what I would do is sacrifice the gym because I need to get my work done and I want to go to this event, so the thing that will sacrifice is the gym. and. I, c I can never really sacrifice from, from work because that's what pays for this place. So it has to come from sleep or like my social stuff, which is the gym and going to events, right? In this case, I've chosen to do the gym and go to the event. So it can't come from work and it can't come from social life. Where does my pulling have to come from? It has to come from my sleep. And that is on a, why am I looking at this watch that is just not existing on my body right now? It has to come from sleep because um, if I want to do all of these things, have this time to let that frustration out of the gym and go and enjoy this event, I don't have the hours in the day to sleep. I know that sounds absurd, but it's only temporary, you know? And I, I am kind of okay with that. Can't lie, don't wanna be yours just for the summer. Don't wanna see you better back with another. Oh, Cough. 
So with my videos, I always like to say, and I always have said this, and, and to be honest, I got this kind of analogy or philosophy, if you like, from, from people that I watch, from your, your Christian Guzmans, your, your Rob Lipsits, your kind of OG fitness industry YouTube people, right? A lot of them always used to say this. If your video can help one person, one person, that's it, you're good, you're golden, you are sorted, you have done your job, you have helped somebody with this piece of content that you've put out there. I'm making this video today to hopefully help somebody realize that something in life has to come from somewhere. You cannot be 100% all in to absolutely everything 100% of the time. Maybe you can be temporarily. Maybe you can sleep enough, have a perfect work-life balance with your social life, go out and see your friends, go on dates with your girlfriend, stuff like that, you know? But that can't last forever. It just can't because you will burn out and you will struggle to maintain that kind of equilibrium, shall we say. So my message to all of you guys watching this video, whether you're a new or old subscriber, whether you're a random person that's just stumbled across this today with the, with the video title or the thumbnail or something like that, stick around by the way. Hi, nice to meet you, my name's Liam. My one message to you, whoever you are, is be okay or at least try your best to be okay with pulling something away from something somewhere. Because if you want to have a little bit of balance, sometimes you do have to sleep a little bit less or sometimes you do have to skip gym. I would never suggest skipping work, especially if you are self-employed. You do not work, you do not get paid. Work, man, you got rent to pay. That's, I do anyway, so that's very specific to me, but I guess it depends on the situation. Um, please, please, please do your best. I say do your best because it's a lot easier said than done, but do your best to be okay with, with taking something away from from your life. And that sometimes may well be the social activity, right? Because if you are too tired, you, <laughs> you cannot go to this social thing because if you've been working too hard and you've been going to the gym and you've been sleeping right, you know, you might not have enough time to do all of these things. Sometimes that may come from, from the social thing. I always try to make it not be the case because that keeps me mentally refreshed, you know, going to these events and, and having fun with my friends and it's just good for me. I have realized to have that kind of, I feel like it's good for everybody, but in, me in particular to have that social life is very important. So I try not to take it from, from the social life, but sometimes needs must. That's all for today, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed this little rant. Um, I feel like if I'd have seen videos like this a good couple of years ago now, I would be a lot further along the process of progressing to being the person that I want to be when it comes to that balance now. So hopefully me putting this message out there can help someone somewhere. Maybe so, maybe not, but you never know. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you all and I will see you in the next one.